So according to the internet, Ronaldo for breakfast starts his day with a high protein breakfast, which includes egg, cheese, and yogurt. So I've got some egg, but I made it as an omelet and put the cheese inside and a strawberry yogurt drink. Because if you're not from the UK, I don't believe they have this in the US. This yogurt drink is actually a drinkable yogurt and it's the best, amazing, and tasting best thing ever. I can't even speak when I think about it. Yogurt, it's like the goat of drinks. It's like the Ronaldo of yogurt drinks. So if you can get a yogurt anywhere, definitely go out and get it, I recommend. While I eat this omelet, I'll tell you the stats and the macros of what's inside here, which is obviously one of the reasons Ronaldo himself has this for breakfast. Calorie wise, this omelet has 640 calories, it has 20 grams of protein. So as a breakfast for the greatest of all time, I can't fault him, this is great. Mmm, actually tastes really good. Maybe that's just down to my cooking, but eggs for breakfast, 10 out of 10. Let's move on to the yogurt. Now I've got it as a drinkable yogurt, like I mentioned, and it's a strawberry flavor one. And as you can see from the, from the sticker on the front, it says source of protein. So each one of these drinks has, so each one of these drinks has 300 calories, just under four grams of fat and 15 grams of protein. So together with that plus this, 35 grams protein breakfast. So in between breakfast and dinner, Cristiano Ronaldo likes to enjoy some dried fruit as his little snack between main meals. He also has it as a between lunch and dinner as well. But for the main thing, between breakfast and lunchtime, he always has dried fruit. So I have some raisins here because that's the only dry fruit that I can get my hands on at the moment. Everything else, like there's some mangoes, but they're like five quid for a pack like this big of dried mangoes. So I was like, nope, I'm not buying that. So enjoy a cool little montage of me eating some dried raisins. Let me just say guys, before we start this section, I'm so annoyed. I just filmed this, but I filmed it in slow motion. Crazy. Anyway, lunchtime. For lunch, Ronaldo likes to have chicken, vegetables, and salad. Now, I don't have any salad because I don't like salad. So I've settled for chicken and vegetables, which you can see on the screen now. So I've got some chicken, which is marinated in butter chicken. Got some cucumber and some baby tomatoes, and that's what I'll have. Give the chicken a taste. Yum. And look how nice that looks, guys. Cooked by me as well, by the way. I made this food. Absolutely lovely. Sometimes he does switch up his lunchtime meal, though. He will either have swordfish, tuna, braised cod, but he absolutely loves and prefers, and it's his favourite, chicken, and he even classes it as magical due to its high protein and low fat content. For him to have the kind of body he does like this, look at this, if it'll load. Look how crazy that physique is. Then he definitely needs this kind of food. Cucumber. It also even says on here, the Portugal international has a personal dietitian who has worked with him ever since his Real Madrid days. He eats six small meals a day or one to every three to four hours. Imagine eating that much a day. And then he even goes on to say that he has eight hours of sleep per night. Imagine being able to get eight hours of sleep per night. I don't know about you guys, but I struggle getting five hours some nights. Oh my gosh. And then even further down, it says he has five 30 minute naps throughout the day. So if you add it all up, he has two and a half hours worth of naps, eight hours, of sleep, 10 and a half hours of the day he's sleeping. So he's only awake for what 13 and a half hours a day and he still fits in how many meals was it six meals a day and trains and family this guy's crazy tomatoes that just went everywhere ew overall i give this meal a 10 out of 10 because this is kind of similar to what i have i normally have like chicken and rice or beef and rice with like cucumbers or something so this meal was perfect for me let's go to the next and i'll try not film it in slow motion next time liverpool Now for his final meal of the day. Any guesses what he eats, let me know in the comments below. Three, two, one. You guessed it, chicken. That's literally it. And more salad, but I'm not eating any more salad. He literally eats the same similar things. And he says, which to be honest, I feel like I'd get pretty bored if I was eating the same food all the time. But then I guess it's like a quick meal. You know what you're eating. It can all be made in bulk. It's easy to make, it's easy to get. So it gives you time to focus on other important things like being the best athlete, the best footballer in the world. Now Ronaldo has this diet because it allows him to have explosive muscles and very low fat mass while supporting the fast metabolism so who knows maybe i'll do this for like six months and then i'll eventually be the greatest footballer of all time make sure you drop a like below for ronaldo's diet so guys that's it for today's video let me know below make sure you give this video a like let me know in the comments below which athlete or person i should do next i'd love to do like a boxer to see what their kind of diet's like because i'm guessing it's more intense than this because they've got to put mass on don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i'll be posting notifications on and i'll be back next week with a new video peace out guys